Well, we are going to focus on this match. There's a good crowd in now that the weather front has settled down. There was a massive storm before. We're hoping that these two will deliver something as equally exciting as that. Of course, it is an all-Egyptian clash. The warrior princess against the gazelle. This first game, I think, is absolutely crucial for El Hamami. If she can, she can squeeze it, then. Definitely. It's not going to be too much skin off Noor's nose if she loses the first. Oh, that's oh. a good shot. We saw that against Tayeb yesterday, Shabini losing the first, but of course remaining Six, four, calm five. and collected. I think she'll be putting in quite a strong case to make sure that these points are included. Oh, yeah, so of course <laughs> they'll be included. <laughs> So, so we're going to see it, aren't oh. we? We're going to see it go up, for sure. Yeah. Quarterfinals in Chicago, semis of this, or final of this. Oh, is. again, she's not the best. Just Random if middle. I can pick one kind of slight and weakness. Um, she's not the best at improvising when it comes at her. Got it. Of course. Go, go, gadget. Legs. I mean, she moves to the middle so easily, and then it's the stretch to the front. Good squash. Oh. Certainly the best rally of the match so far. <laughs> it's finished <laughs> off by Helen and Mammy. Very impressive from the youngster because she covered what would normally be Shabini winners by both players there looking to push up and fighting for that area. Absolutely. She is quite the gazelle. She's animalistic at times. Hand out. 7-5. And just the intensity in, in her face, you can even see, like, facially, she's just so, so hungry to get onto the ball and focused, and the desire is just massive right now. And that's something that Shabini's going to have to battle with. She's just come off of winning the final in Windy City. She's slightly mentally oh. drained. She's out, Shabini. Shabini with the trickle boast. 9-7. I mean, this is very high-quality squash. Bit of a shocker on the return. Three errors from Mammy. Oh, Make that four, wow. she didn't even hit it. 11-9. That is why you can't see the finishing line too early. You have to stay nice and calm and calculated right until the end. Shabini will take you out. She's just there watching. So she gets up, standing still, watching. Back to the middle. Oh, oh she can't do anything about that. Beautiful. Trademark Shabini up high on and the down. volley. She doesn't miss that very often, and oh, she's that was got coming. her. She's taken the <laughs> Uber bus, Noel Shabini. She's got her. Nine all. Watch this. She's on her way to Alexandria John. for that one. Through Well, she's using oh. angles. El Hamami, <laughs> the cross court flick is her friend. And out. She's twisting her and she you is know, twisting some fist bumps. Well, she loves the twist it and shout. Scurrying around, Hani El Hamami, yeah. staying in this rally. Certainly under the cosh. Oh. Well, there you go, Got there's it. the twist and shout. <laughs> Well, oh, Hamami's done it. Hamami leads two games to one. She's not changing the ball, is she? She's going to be exhausted at this rate. I know. All these it, celebrations. Yeah, Here the we go. Here's she has twist changed and the ball. Well, that's why they are such good movers as well, because they grow up having to retrieve all these, all this attacking squash. Yeah. I mean, oh, that's just slotted away from Shabini. 
Yeah, rash effort across court, Nick. From Anya, annoyed with herself there, way well, too high. Well, she should be, but this game has disappeared from her very quickly. I yes, oh, no. <laughs> That's brilliant. Nicely finished. I mean, it was great Hang movement down. in there again from Hamami. I mean, you Get really more. don't see Shabini scurrying around the court. A bit strange. Don't see that please. often either from Shabini. No. Can't quite work out. She had a, a line through to this ball. How far back is the ball by the time she goes into her mammy? That's the. Can she go behind to go get that? Oh, from that angle, not really. So well, there you go. Stroke confirmed. That is the game. Should have volleyed that or not? Oh, <laughs> well, there you go. Why volley if you can just play that off the back? Just slam it into the nick. Straight. Hand out. And I don't want to miss the ending of it. I'm going to have to run down. Love what a shot. Oh, that's oh, brilliant. Brilliant. brilliant stuff. There's the twist and shout. We haven't seen it for a while. It's been locked away for two games, but what right, a right. rally and what a time to produce it. Oh, it's a brilliant shot. Calmness personified from Shabini. Each player has one review available. Oh, she's done it. She's done it. Hania El Hamami has defied the odds here. The 19 year old has beaten the four time world champion, Noel Shabini, to claim her first platinum title. Unbelievable. The 19 year old has 71 minutes of pure, enthralling, entertaining squash between these two. The warrior princess taken out by the gazelle. Hania El Hamami beating Noor El Shabini 3-2. And it was only 13-11 in a tie break that could separate them. Wow. <laughs> Hania, I'm not sure where to start. What an unbelievable week of squash. I mean, you're sat here with a trophy, your first ever platinum win. What are you feeling right now? I'm out of words, really. Uh, I think I played the toughest matches of my career throughout this week. Um, like I did a lot of effort this week to win this title, and I'm really proud of what I did this week, and hopefully I can just keep keep going and keep making the same efforts. Um, I worked on my weaknesses. I, uh, I think I improved my physical game, my squash game, and I'm really happy to be able to beat all the top players now. <laughs>